The dog was looking at me with a, don't drag me into this. Have you seen these stuff they make me eat? <laughs> Father Simon and the Confessional Collective of Care and Compassion. I seek your forgiveness for something that has haunted me for most of my adult life. I've tried to block it from my mind, but no, I fear I must come clean. Let me take you back to the mid 1970s, a simpler time with simpler tastes. In those days, we sat and ate as a family. Nobody left the table till their plate was cleared. Menu choices were also a lot simpler. Take it or, well, actually, just take it. <laughs> yeah. You cannot leave it. The only food I didn't particularly like back then was mashed potatoes. Remember, we're talking simpler times before potato ricers saved us from lumpy mash. I did not like mashed potatoes, and I absolutely <laughs> detested lumpy mashed potatoes. On one occasion, our dish of the day came with lumpy mashed potatoes. Oh, no. I could not face them, but Dad was insistent. In a voice that sounded... I'm going to say like Ray Winston. <laughs> oh, again. Even, even wow. though we lived in Paisley, and, oh. he, and he normally sounded like Billy Connolly. Right. He bellowed out the warning. <laughs> well... <laughs> You're not leaving the table until your plate is cleared, well. my son. <laughs> wow. I couldn't do that as Billy Connolly. No, Come you on. couldn't. Dad cleared his plate. Mum cleared her plate. Even my goody two-shoes sister yeah. finished the meal. All three left the kitchen table and went next door to watch television, leaving just the dog, me, <laughs> and a plate of by now cold, lumpy, mashed oh. potatoes. Now, I had, a I had a dilemma. I couldn't leave the room till the tatties had been disposed of. But remember that parenting styles in the 70s were also <laughs> radically different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I had to find a way of disposal that didn't risk punishment. I thought of the bin, but Dad was sure to look there. I thought of giving them to the dog, but if he didn't eat them, I'd be in trouble. Besides, the dog was looking at me with a, <laughs> don't drag me into this. Have you seen these stuff they make me eat? <laughs> Face. <laughs> There was only one option. Could I? Would it work? Yes, genius. I stuffed the potatoes into the pockets of my school trousers. Right. Which, oh. I, was, which I was still wearing. <laughs> oh, good. Finish, Dad! I shouted through to the next room in my childlike high-pitched, <laughs> voice not yet broken, broad Scottish brogue. <laughs> of course, too yeah. late for Too late for the stage oh, directions. Oh, so unfortunate. The door opened. With a menacing silence, Dad looked at me and then looked at the empty plate. The dog looked away, trying to make himself invisible. <laughs> the bin was duly opened. Nothing. Dad was baffled. He knew I wouldn't have eaten them. He knew that I knew that he knew. <laughs> <laughs> he stared me out, but I did not crack. Okay, you can leave the table. No. He reluctantly conceded in a voice sounding like Sir Alex Ferguson, manager of our local football team at the right. time. Again, too late with the directions oh, dear. there. Oh. I had one remaining problem, though. Two pockets full of mashed potatoes oh. in my trousers. I excused myself and went to the toilet. My walk, though, was a little weird and squelchy. <laughs> I considered trying to flush them away, but what if they didn't go round the bend? You know what that's like. To get caught out at this stage would mean that not even Esther Ranson could help me. <laughs> 70s TV reference. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> I took the only option available to me. I threw them out the window. <laughs> Father Simon, both mum and dad are no longer with us, but that said, it's not forgiveness on their behalf that I seek. I don't seek my dad's forgiveness for my lies in subterfuge. No child should be made to eat lumpy mashed potatoes. I don't even seek my mum's forgiveness for wasting her food. She had the Fanny and Johnny Craddock cookbook collection. Mashed potato is not difficult to get right, mum. I do feel bad about the trousers going into the washing basket, calling my bedroom floor in that condition, but my mum was expecting that kind of thing. Father Simon, I admitted one small detail. We lived four stories up in a oh, tenement flat. What? <laughs> and I seek forgiveness on behalf of the innocent passers-by who were hit <laughs> oh, no. by an aerial bombardment of mash. I couldn't see who they were precisely, <laughs> but hopefully they can just blame mutant seagulls in the paisley sky. Can you and the collective please find it in your hearts to forgive me? Well, I mean, it's, I, I think it shows an awful lot of invention and a lot of creativity on Alan's behalf. What do you do with lumpy mashed potato? Sister Susie, what do you say? 
Yeah, I think, Alan, I think you did really well there with your inventiveness and throwing it out of the window. That squidge, though, imagine that squidge in the pockets would just be... And imagine dried up mashed potato mum trying to wash those trousers the next day just not very nice really uh, but I can't forgive you Alan for one reason I love mashed potato and I, ca I can't see why no one else would not love it lumps or no lumps so therefore I can't forgive you harsh harsh but maybe <laughs> fair brother from another guy. I mean I also love mashed potato but we shouldn't judge Alan for his wee blind spot on on <laughs> no. the on the potato I think I'm going to forgive and the, and the reason is this I mean, it's a perfect crime really isn't it no one was hurt uh, but frankly it looked very much <laughs> like seagulls didn't it and I know I know if I'd been there I'd have thought well that looks like a seagull rather than uh, mashed potato so I think everyone was fine in the end and even the dog managed to come out of it well so uh what does he have to eat? Um, I'm gonna, I'm gonna forgive. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's one all in the studio, like it usually is. So Ever. it's, in, it's entirely down to you. Do you forgive Alan for his mashed potato crime? <laughs>